you know what time it is? It's pasta time. Pasta time. Pasta time. Pasta time. Hi guys, we're back in the kitchen with the brilliant Lena and we're doing a special recipe today. It's all about carb loading. So I'm excited, I'm running a half marathon in two weeks and I've been training by running, but also part of training and gearing up for a long distance run is also sleep and nutrition. What are we making today, Lena? Okay, so we're making a bean-based pasta with a spinach walnut pesto. The carbs in this are really healthy carbs, so they're yes. complex carbs rather than simple carbs, so they don't convert to sugar right away in your blood. They give you a nice, long, sustained energy, so you're not gonna like have a rush of energy and then crash. So we're boiling some water here. We've just added um, like a nice handful of salt. It's Why do we add salt to, to water when you're boiling it? So it actually lowers the boiling temperature of water. Oh. So it boils faster. And then also the pasta comes out with a little bit of flavor. Okay, so side note, we are um, a little low on a microphone cord. So we're sharing one. <laughs> doesn't really mean anything to you guys other than we're walking around the kitchen like idiots, like strapped at the hip and just like, come, come, we're gonna come get the salt. Over here. <laughs> so, you know, if you see us just like tripping over ourselves, that's why. Okay, okay kale. Okay, so we're gonna take this kale. This we're gonna, a lot of kale. It's a lot of kale, but the thing about kale is it shrinks. If you've ever made kale chips, like yes. this, which is basically, this is the same method for making kale chips, but we're just mm -hmm. not gonna cook it for as long. We're just gonna that's tear, true. yeah, tear and toss. Tear and toss, okay. Uh, you can leave some of the lighter stems in there, but we'll take the big ones out. <laughs> I'm not the only one running the Berlin Half Marathon. My entire classy team is in it with me. So we're gonna make a double portion of this pasta dish. Hence why we have so much kale. Oh, we got okay. It. Okay, how are we gonna do? come this way? Right, right, right. <laughs> Lena and I are artists. You can't uh, tell us what to do, how much to True. measure, how long to do it for, mm -mm. until we like burn the house down. So today we're gonna set a timer. Yes, how girl. long do we want to set it for? Uh, let's do twelve minutes to 12 start, minutes? and then we'll check on it. So, okay. in the meantime. In the meantime, we have twelve minutes to we do got the rest. Twelve minutes. First, we're gonna chop the garlic because we want to activate the acetylene. Okay. Ooh, fancy. Yes. Oh, I may have overdone it. No, that's um, perfect. It doesn't, we're about to chop it anyways. Squash it with the knife mm -hmm. and the peel comes right off. Right da -da -da -da. Off. So we're just gonna leave this off to the side now. It's gonna activate. And in the meantime, we're going mm. to get out our food processor okay. and it. start Rotate on- Rotate to the right. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, here we go, here we go. Wait. Okay. Basically what we're doing is we're, we're packing in the spinach just so we okay. can measure it. So this is a two cup measuring device and we've packed it really tight. We can probably tight. Yeah, we, we can let's smash it in there. So we're just gonna pulse it a few times. And then we're gonna add, this is uh, one and a half ounces of basil. Oh my gosh. It smells insane. Honestly, oh, if that was a perfume, I think I would wear a perfume <laughs> just of basil. <laughs> Maybe you should make I'm that. I'm such a loser. <laughs> we're just gonna pull off the, uh, the stems. It doesn't have to be perfect. I can smell the kale, let's check on it. Oh, wait, Just, hold on. I got you a handy dandy timer. Uh, seven seconds, look at you. <laughs> I mean, she doesn't measure, she doesn't time, <laughs> but yeah, she's always right. right. What can I okay. say? Okay, okay. Well, let's stay out of your way, you go. You Which go. way do I go? All you, all you. Other way, other way, other way. This way, yeah. okay. Got you. Oh, deal. <laughs> wow, oh wow. Okay. We're about to burn the house Check down. it out. This is, this is actually exactly how I wanted it. Okay, great. I mean, try, try one of those. Oh yeah. Mmm. Isn't this so delicious? <laughs> <laughs> and now we're just gonna add the walnuts. Ooh. It might be better to do it in this and then you give it a little more. Okay, you're doing, well, this you're doing so good. <laughs> you know, this Killing just it. trying to multitask here. You're doing, you do the talking, I'll do the pouring. This is okay. great. We're gonna do um, some lemon zest. Gotcha. So there's the lemon zest. We're also gonna add some lemon juice. With half the lemon? Yep, half the lemon. Okay. So it actually goes in the other way. Okay, just kidding, hang on. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're gonna add about half a teaspoon of salt to start. I know, you think that's more. That was way more. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> and then um, we're gonna add olive oil. Pour it in. A little bit of nutritional yeast. Mm, how much? <laughs> um, we'll add uh, about a, a quarter cup. Four tablespoons is a quarter cup. Let's put it all in. This is gonna be real all garlicky, it. yeah. Okay. This was, I think we did four or five cloves. So toss that in. Woo! 
Oh, yeah, baby. <laughs> okay. Wow, that smells so good. Oh my God. I think we may have, may have nailed it. <laughs> I'm just gonna be uh, honest here for a second. Lena and I were arguing a little bit about our favorite kind of gluten-free pasta because there's so many out there on the market. This is this is Lena's choice. <laughs> Explain why it's your choice. Okay. And I'll combat with my argument. <laughs> Okay, okay, so my choice is the chickpea pasta for a couple of reasons. It's made strictly from beans. And when you combine beans with nuts, you get a complete protein, which is all nine amino acids. Also the shape of this pasta and mm. the ridges will hold the pesto really well, and it'll mix well with the roasted kale. Uh-huh, okay, are you done now? <laughs> I'm done. <clears throat> Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen. This <laughs> is my favorite kind of pasta. This one I like because it's lower in carbs and high in protein and in fiber. Mm -hmm. And it tastes really good. So and I will, you I, will, that? I will give it to you that soy is a complete protein. Right. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna make yours. Should we have, a, should we have like a throw down? <laughs> I'd be mine versus yours. Woo, hot stuff. Watch your face. Coming at you. Okay, wow, that looks amazing. Can I use metal spoons? Because I don't want to place the pesto on here. Yeah. Give me some more pesto. I need some more. Carly literally just said, I need to use the metal spoon because the wooden spoon will absorb the pesto and that needs less pesto. <laughs> <laughs> this is really, I feel like we're both biased. Mmm. <laughs> mmm. Wow, that's so tasty. <laughs> so good. Oh my god. <laughs> I love you, Lena. You know I love you. I know. I'm a little bit of a food you. hog, though. I am. I don't share your food with anyone. Really? Yeah. Um, okay. okay. Cheers. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mine's better. I'm, I mean, <laughs> guys, this is delicious. You don't want to miss out on this. Trust me. Uh, it's easy to make. Have it stored in your fridge for a after run snack or meal or take it to the office uh, for lunch the next day. This is so good. Or it's just a dinner, just a weekday dinner. Yeah, it's so simple. It's so yummy. Action packed with nutrients and protein and all sorts of good stuff. Guys, if you're enjoying this video as much as I'm enjoying this bowl of pasta, you know you want to subscribe. You have to subscribe. You have to subscribe because we're going to be doing more amazing things like this. So stop what you're doing. Stop watching this video. I'm going to not share my pasta. Let's just subscribe. Cheers. Yay!